watching Action News Now. Breaking news. We are tracking several breaking news stories at this 4 o'clock hour. First, you are looking live at the Salt Fire burning east of I-5 near the Salt Creek exit. It's in Shasta County, just east of Lakehead. That fire is forcing evacuations. We do have team coverage on that fire. We'll get over to Chief Meteorologist Jason Stiff in just a few moments. But first, let's get right out to Anna Terea leading us off from that fire. Anna, what can you tell us right now? Well, we know this fire has burned more than 20 acres and behind me you can see that thick smoke coming from the fire. Let me just step out of the frame and show you what it's looking like out there. Take a look right there as I zoom in for you. Like I mentioned, that thick smoke and if I move the camera just a little bit, that tiny dot right there, those are the aircrafts that have been making those water drops out on this fire as well. Now, when I was driving up to the up to this area, there were signs warning people of the fire activity out here. And when I was also uh, on scene, they had blocked off one lane of I-5. CHP had blocked it off to let fire crews work. And that area of I-5 had slowed down traffic just a bit. Like I mentioned earlier, several aircrafts making water drops out here. Here's one heading back right now. Cal Fire is also on scene helping out with this incident, but this incident is being overseen by the Forest Service and right now we are working to figure out what caused this fire and I am monitoring this and I will bring you the latest information as it becomes available. So for now, reporting live in Shasta County, Anna Torreya, Action News Now coverage you can count on. Thank you for that, Anna. And important to point out that you saw in Anna's live shot, I-5 still moving in both directions near that fire at this time. We'll continue to monitor that out there. Now we're talking about those evacuations. Here they are right on your screen. The Shasta County Sheriff's Office says that an evacuation center has been set up at the Central Valley High School. We are 